So to create an image on Textsoft Design Tools, go online, I'm going to take my Art Nouveau image, paste it, and there's two ways I can convert this into a format the laser cutter can understand. If I go into bitmaps, contour bitmap, change the space into zero, it'll take a moment to load. Then what's happened now is that it's made an outline around the design. I don't want to locate it, I want to go back to the arrow to select, and I will move it off. If I want this engraved, I will select it and change the line color to red, as the laser cutter will understand, to simply do an engraving in red. Now, if I want all these sections filled in, I don't think it will look as good, but I can also select the fill option, choose a solid fill, and again, red for the color. The way to do this, if you've got an image which hasn't got um, a simple black and white design, would be going to bitmaps, vectorize bitmap, what I'll do is I'll select monochrome, and if I change the luminance, I can select what will be included and what won't be included there. And I'll have it somewhere in between. Of course, this will create a far grainier image. If you want it um, flipped, you can also invert it as well. I will change the color as well, the foreground to red. To get rid of the excess information, I'll go edit, clip to box the box over and trim clip inside and there you go two wonderful art nouveau designs ready for laser cutting all the best with it let me know if you need any help and i um i look forward to seeing what you produce